Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back with a brand new video into my channel, Apex. And guys, here today in this video, I'm gonna show you how to fix out the low GP usage on your PC while you gaming or using your PC on your any old or new gen PCs. So guys, just if this is your first time here onto my channel, so guys, make sure to subscribe it and turn on the notification. So guys, without wasting any time, let's go straight into this video. So guys, you will see here the interface of my AMD Radeon performance tab and you will see here my GP usage. And guys, Fortnite is uh, now running in my background, you will see here 98% GP usage and it is giving me the best performance and the maximum performance of my GPU on my this game. I have the i5-2500K, I just show you here my PC specs. But guys, make sure to watch this complete video till the end and I'm going to show you with the proof how can you guys do the best setting for your GPU for getting the best performance? So just go into the property and you will see here I have the uh, Intel Core i5 2500K CPU which is the 3.30 GHz and the GPU is the RX 560. For just checking out my GPU just go into the home sections. Uh, scroll down and just here is some detail of my GPU. Uh, I don't know where it is uh, right now here. But guys, I have the RX 560. So just uh, you can do the all this step for the Nvidia or also for the AMD. It is not uh, any problem. So just guys, you need to just update your driver onto the latest version. So you will see here I have the update available on my this uh, AMD. So just download the latest driver on your PC. Just after updating your driver, now you need to just go into the uh, display setting. But before I'm just show you here. I'm just playing Fortnite here on the Creative in the fortnite uh, so you can check it out here my fps i'm getting to stable 120 uh, uh, 120 fps like that uh, and guys uh, i'm also show you how can you guys get this stable fps in this video so just make sure you guys stick with this video to the end so guys uh, let's go here onto the display setting go right click here on your desktop and go for the display settings now from here the most important setting you need to just select out the resolution where you play so most of people Play with the stretch resolution so just create a native or the custom resolution on your pc which is the stretch but probably i am playing with the 1440 multiplied by 1000 or 1440 multiplied by 900 which is the recommended but most of people play with the 1920 multiplied by 1080 so i just create a custom resolution on my pc so just select out this resolution and just after selecting out it now you need to just go for the graphic settings from this list add here the fortnite game or gd5 any game which you play go for the browse sections and go for the directory of the fortnite where you install it fortnite folder go for the fortnite game binary win64 and here is all these files select out the fortnite uh, client win64 sharing file click here on this add button and just it will add it into this list now go for the application right click here go for the options and just set it onto the high performance save the setting and just close out this window just after doing the setting now you need to just go for the game which we play like i'm playing fortnite so i just go for the settings of the fortnite for the windows modes and the windows full screen so just you need to select here the windows full screen here and it will automatically uh, detect the resolution of your pc like i have uh, now playing with the uh, 1920 multiplied by 1080p when i just restart my pc so it will show me here the resolution but now it is uh, showing me 1440 because i'm uh, playing with this resolution so just after just doing the windows full screen resolution uh, on your pc in your game fortnite now scroll down and just enable out this option which is the directx 12 beta version just enable all these options in your fortnite and just restart your game just after enabling out this setting and guys if you have the 8 core processor like i have 4 core processors i5 2500k so i just have 4 core so just disable out this option but if you have more than 4 core like 8 core 16 core so just enable out the multi threading running on your game so just after applying the setting restart your game and you will get the best performance of your gpu in all these games so guys i hope so after doing the setting you will get the best performance of your gpu on your pc so guys make sure to tell me in the comment section what are you thinking about this video and make sure to also leave a like onto this video subscribe to my channel turn on the notification so guys see you later in the next video allah hafiz and bye bye